Kit Curry had everything any young man wanted. Looks, a great career, and not to mention the attention of the ladies. Then it all came crashing around him after a motor vehicle collision. He is now rebuilding his life in When the Brave Fall. Hi Kit, how does it feel to finish your first week at Antillian Airlines? Hi Leone, it feels good you know, but I'm also looking forward to the weekend. First step to relaxation is watching the dirt bike trial tomorrow. Oh really no, Mr. Bogle wants to see you, he's in his office. Kit has the nerve. A few months ago, his bike crashed and caused the death of a little girl and his pillion rider still cannot walk and he has the stomach to go out to a bike race. Come in, Corey. Good afternoon, Mr. Bogle. This won't be long. Do you have a little time to wrap with some young people tomorrow morning? Well, what time... Good of you to volunteer. Pastor Metcalf will be expecting you at the Twelve Apostles' mission at this address. Tomorrow at 10. Okay. It's the next door in Greenwich Town. We need to reach out more to the community. Some of the boys over there start flinging stones at the plane again. Greenwich Town? I must drive to Greenwich Town? Is there a problem, Corey? Uh, no, Mr. Bogle. I'll be there. 10 shop. Children, we have a special guest today to tell us about his profession. You is a police? <laughs> no, no. Why do you think I'm a policeman, though? Because you're wearing a uniform and you have a gun. Well, I am an airline pilot. I carry a licensed firearm for my protection. You work at the airport cross there, sir? Yes, yes, I deliver packages. My father is a bear like you, and he takes me on his back sometimes. Okay. <laughs> sir, is a one-way road the plane them have over there? <laughs> you're very smart. We call that road a runway, okay? And we have to take off and land into the wind, which usually comes from the east. So it does look like the runway is one way. In the air, we have rules, and our instruments help us to obey the rules. And that makes flying very safe. Aviation also has many good careers for people with a head for logics and maths. Tell me, which is higher? 4,000 feet above Tinson Pen or 4,000 feet above Mount Rosser? Mount Rosser? But everything computerized, so if you know which button for push, you can fly anything. Hey, Bobby, come inside. Join us. You don't have to stay by the door. <laughs> True, Bobby. A lot of aviation is automated, and that takes away human error. But in an emergency, the skill of the pilot still makes the difference. If that happened, we're all dead anyway. Boom. Not today, Bobby. We're trying to learn something new, something positive. When I was a really young pilot, one day I had to fly out supplies to a bauxite factory. Shh, story! Story! The fuel gauge read 525 pounds and the manifesto total was 137 pounds of cargo. The plane itself is 1620 pounds and maximum takeoff weight was 2400. So what was your weight? <laughs> Fully dressed, 165 pounds. Then you had 3 pounds to spare. You are correct. Very good. And the plane wheels looked a bit spread out, but I didn't double check. On takeoff, the plane struggled to lift off and then went back down. I accelerated halfway down the runway. The front wheel finally came up again, but it was such a struggle. I had to put the plane back down. As soon as it came to a complete halt, it pivoted on the back wheels and the tail hit the runway with nose in the air. It's what happened. An engine block was recorded as 11 pounds instead of 110 pounds on the manifesto. I was a hundred pounds overweight. If the wind was strong, the plane would have taken off and fallen like a stone right here on Greenwich Farm. So, who was wrong? Well, listen, at that point it didn't matter, you know. Ultimately, I was responsible. If I'd been watching them pack the plane instead of chatting up with the receptionist, I would have known that an engine block was on board and picked up the error. In aviation, the cost of mistakes is very high. But for one simple pencil stroke, it could have been someone else standing here today and not me. I want to come over and watch you take off. Me too! <laughs> All of you can come. What about you, Bobby? Him friend them come for him, so him gone. I understand. Life is a process. When I was 16, I thought I knew everything too. I'm glad that I met you guys today. <laughs> 
Join Kit Curry again next time as he rebuilds his life in When the Brave Fall.